See, I've been trying to work on my flirting. Right now, I just say hello a lot. And um, oh. people don't seem to understand that that means I want to be with them. Oh, you know what might help you? What? If we if we rehearsed or uh, role-played a situation, that's way you can get know. better I'm at it. I'm not that good at role-play. Oh, never you've never role-played before? No. Oh, you should try it. All right, here. I will be some hunk at the speakeasy, see? And you want to come flirt with this hunk at the speakeasy, all right? All right, I'll be I'll be myself, and you'll be a hunk named Susie. Ooh, yes, yes. But not, of course, my Susie. My Susie's a taken, you know, with me. Just someone that's very similar to you. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, hey, I'm Susie. I'll take one mint julep, please, bartender. If only I had somebody to buy this or share this with. Hello there. Oh, what? Oh, did I get in line before you? I'm sorry. You can go ahead first. Sure. Um, where are you from? Oh, wait, are you talking to me? Yes, please, answer. Oh, yes, please. Oh, so wow, desperate, you please. You're desperate? I'm desperate for uh, socialization, not not anything flirtatious. Oh, okay. Um, you asked me where I'm from? Yes, yes. I'm from Chicago, but I might stand over here by the jukebox. Uh, I'll be over here, bartender, okay? I'm gonna keep walking with you. We're both oh. heading away from the bartender. Oh, you, you want to come to the jukebox too? I guess that's fine, and I don't feel like you're following me at all. Awesome, awesome. Um, uh, h how are you? Oh, you talking to me again? Yes, please. Oh, yes, yes. You don't have to say please all the time. You <laughs> just say yes. Oh, I'm doing swell. Actually, I'm a little sad, to be honest. I, I just got dumped. Oh, well, who would dump a pretty, pretty face like that? <laughs> me? Oh, yes, yes. the president of the United States. They dumped me. They said I wasn't cut out for the White House. Um. I said, uh, please, please let me in the White House, but they wouldn't let me. And now here I am at this speakeasy, just sitting here alone. Would you, would, do you want me to break into the White House for you? What? You can do that? I can, I, I'd do anything for you. What's your name? John. John, yes, J J John. Please, please break into the White House for me. I, I actually sneak- You want sneak me to steal anything? Well, I actually have these blueprints that I snuck out, see? Don't tell anybody, though. Don't tell anybody, but I have these blueprints, and they are a little stinky. Don't worry about where I had to put them when I left, but listen, just take these blueprints, see? And I need you to go steal. There's a secret map. It's on the back- Is it on- uh, I think I know what you're saying about- is it on the back of a, a declaration? What? No, no, it's actually on the back of a toilet. I, I see. I put the map. I had taken the map, but I put it on the back of a toilet. <laughs> back of the declaration. That would be crazy. Imagine. Well, I was thinking, I would just steal it and check the back, because you never know. There's maps on everything. Oh yes, yes. You can go. Yes, actually, that's a great plan. You, why don't? Why, when you when you're going to the bathroom, why don't you stop by the Declaration of Independence and just go ahead and take that too. All right. I mean, that's. I think it's pretty simple. You just like grab it. Yes, they have them John. Everywhere. Yes, yes, John. You're my hero, John. Wait, how much? How much is this gonna run me? See, I, I, I don't have too much money now, John. And did you not hear? I'd do anything for you, and it would be free of charge. You're gonna do this for me, free of charge? Yes. You know if. It's really too bad that you're taken because me being single, you really seem like somebody that I would jive with. Wait, why do you think I'm taken? Well, a person like you, surely you're taken. You have every eyeball in this place on you right now. I mean, look, everybody's staring at us. The thing is because we're talking very loud about stealing from the White House. <laughs> oh, that's probably it. I, I have been shouting out about how the president dumped me. Yeah, and you look kind of familiar. Oh, yes, yes. I did have that big press conference earlier this morning. 
I don't think they're really looking at me. I think they're more looking at you. Yes, yes. It's probably the runny eye makeup running down my face that I didn't clean up since the press conference today. All right, so, so I'll Look, I'll just because I... Look, and I want you to know that, John, I know you said you'd do anything for me, but look, just because I need the Secret Service men right in the groin doesn't mean I'm crazy, okay? You've done that too? Wait, you've done that? Well, I do that. I, I need anybody. You have need of secret servicemen in the groin as well? If you need every person you see, you are going to run into a secret serviceman. Oh my god, John! Let's get married! But I'm taken. Oh, I forgot. I'm sorry. I, I got so taken aback by how, how macho you are and how you're ready to break into the White House where the Declaration of Independence absolutely is and steal it. The, the way you're saying that makes us, me think it's not there. It's absolutely in there. I, I trust it. All right. Well, uh, I'll just let I. Well, we can be friends. Oh, friends. That's fine. Here I was ready to marry you and love you forever. No, I'm not into that. Wow. And scene. Excellent uh, work. I always get friend zone.